Hey everyone, and welcome back to another Roblox Studio tutorial. Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a door in Roblox. So this is what you're going to be learning today. It's a door attached to a hinge. And because of that, it moves just like a regular door would with physics. So if you want to learn how to make that, just follow along. First, we're going to import a part, and we're going to call this part door. And you can resize this to whatever size you want your door to be. And then you're going to duplicate your door and make a small little frame on the side that you want the door to swing from. So when I open the door, I want it to swing this way. So I'm going to put the frame on the left side of my door. And I'm going to rename it to door frame. Then inside of my door, I'm going to add an attachment. And I'm going to name this attachment door attachment. Inside of the door frame, I'm going to add another attachment. And I'm going to name this frame attachment. Inside of the door, I'm going to add a hinge constraint. And inside of the hinge constraint, I'm going to scroll down, go to attachment 0, and select the door's attachment. Then go to attachment 1, and select the door frame attachment. Then select the move tool, select the door attachment, and you're going to put it on the side of the door that you want it to swing from. Make sure it is on the surface of the door. And then you're going to rotate it so that the yellow pole is facing up. And that the orange pole is facing towards the door frame. Then for the door frame attachment, you're going to put it on the surface as well. Then rotate it so that the yellow pole is facing up. And that the orange pole is facing the door. Now that you've gotten the hinges attached, go to the door. Make sure that it is unanchored. Then go to the door frame and make sure that it is anchored. And now your door is done, but we need something that is collidable to stop the door. So I'm going to import a part. And I'm going to make this the same size as my door frame. And this is going to be my wall, pretty much. I just have to make sure that this is anchored as well, and that can collide is on, so that the door can collide with it and not just infinitely spin in space. And now your door is done, so let's go check it out inside of the game. So now, as you can see, if I touch the door, it swings. And it hits the wall so that it doesn't rotate anymore. And of course, this wall is a little big, so I let me just rescale it down. And now if I test it out again, the door can swing a little bit more. And of course, you can adjust this to whatever you want. You can add more mass to the door. You can do whatever you want. You can experiment with this as much as you'd like. But anyways, that is how to make a door in Roblox Studio. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.